What's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video and today I am doing a late resource pack Monday and today I'm doing the John Smith's legacy resource pack. Now this resource pack is really really great it's HD as well it's only 32 times 32 the one I have but it is very very nice and it does look absolutely amazing. Now I just want to do a kind of recap on last week why no videos came out and all this sort of stuff well um, <laughs> last week was kind of a weird week because there's a lot of stuff going on, plus I am building my new PC as well, so uh, some parts came for that and, you know, I had to put it together and all that sort of stuff. Um, so, yeah, that kind of took up some time and then obviously I couldn't get a video on Monday and then Tuesday came, couldn't get my, uh, couldn't get both videos on then. Wednesday then came and I had three videos to do and it just all sort of caved in on me while I was trying to build my new PC college all sorts all sorts of stuff all uh, jumbled together so hopefully now I can get this one out for you guys for this week and I'm sorry again it's late um, but yeah it's I, I was just trying to catch up on last week to be honest but anyway this is the John Smith legacy um, pack is 32 times 32 like I just said and you also may need hit, um, MC patcher or optifine now I'm using MC patcher HD I hope I hope I am anyway. I'm using one of them, <laughs> uh, but I will have a link to both of them, so you know you can choose which one you want to use, or you can install both, uh, whichever one is better for you. Um, or oh, Optifine is really good as well. It, it does allow you to zoom in on stuff as well. So if you press like Shift, it will, or is it Control, one of them, it will allow you to zoom in. You can see a lot further to, um, you know, to where you are. So yeah, with the um, me talking about my building my new PC, uh, comes the chance of me being able to do a lot higher texture packs. Now on this video, I want you guys to put a comment down below on the higher up texture packs, 128, 256, the really good ones that you guys recommend, because I really want to write some down and get a list of you know really good HD uh, texture packs, because I'll be able to do really high end uh, texture pack reviews, and I really can't wait for that. It's going to be so good. So yeah, you guys, you know, just uh, just just uh, you know keep keep your eyes open because coming in January, maybe February. We'll, all that sort of stuff will uh, start happening and you know hopefully more videos will be coming out as well because my PC will be able to render videos a lot more faster and all this sort of stuff that's going to be absolutely amazing and I really can't wait. So okay sorry about taking up probably about three minutes of this video. Sorry about that I just wanted to get you know kind of an explanation out of the way. Let's dive in to this awesome looking texture pack. So okay so first of all as you can see the actual crosshair on the uh, texture pack, it's very, very small. It's directly right in the middle of the thing. It's right there. It's so small, it's unreal. Um, but yeah, it's right there. You, you can see it. It's very, very small. I uh, just wish that was a tiny little bit bigger. Um, you know, just it's like it's smaller than than, a, than one pixel on it. Just that, that's a pixel there, I believe, or some sort of a pixel anyway. And it's so small, it's unreal. Also, I like the hot bar as well. The hot bar looks really, really nice down here. It's not too big. Uh, that's because obviously I set mine to small, but yeah, down here looks absolutely gorgeous. It looks really, really great. All these as well, all these uh, buttons and stuff, all looking absolutely great. And uh, yeah, looking really, really good. So let's get into the actual um, stuff. So first one, I'm just going to set time to 600, so you know we've got more daytime. And uh, the sun should be over there. Sun is round as well, looking awesome. So yeah, let's start off with the, uh, the wooden tool. So this is the shovel, the pickaxe, the axe, and the hoe. We've also got the stone tools here, so we've got the stone pickaxe, uh, the stone shovel, sorry, the pickaxe, the axe, and the hoe. And the one thing I like about this is they've got like rope around the stick and like the bit of the stone to like show as, as a shovel. Same with the axe up here and here and here. Uh, looking really, really great uh, on the hoe as well there. So that's really cool. So we've got iron tools as well. We've got the iron shovel, pickaxe, axe, and hoe. Also we've got gold tools. We've got the gold shovel, pickaxe, axe, and hoe. And of course, the diamond tools as well. So the diamond shovel, pickaxe, axe, and the hoe. Let's move on to the armor. So we've got the leather armor here. So we've got the stone sword and all the leather armor. To me, that doesn't look... I mean, it's changed, but not that much. It hasn't, you know, changed a lot. Like, like the boots have changed. The leggings have changed. The hat doesn't look that much different to the normal one. I think it's got like a stripe down the middle, but I'm not too sure if that's, you know, still the same. And of course, the chest plate has, has changed as well, but not a lot. Um, this is the chainmail armor. So we've got the sword, the uh, and, you know the chainmail armor. They, they kept it the same sort of style with all of these, but they just sort of put dots on them and stuff like that to make them look like chainmail. So that's really cool. 
Moving on to iron. So we've got the iron sword and all the armor here as well. Looks really nice. Moving on to gold. So we've got gold armor or the gold sword, sorry, and the gold armor there. It's really nice. And of course, diamond as well. And there's diamond. So all those four are kind of the same apart from um, the leather over there. Okay, so let's move on to the blocks. So first what we have is bedrock. And uh, yeah, bedrock looks really nice as well. Liking that. We have cobblestone up here and normal smooth stone. We then move on to all of the ores and all that sort of stuff. So we've got redstone. So we've got redstone dust, redstone block, redstone ore. Gold ingot, gold block, gold ore. Iron ingot, iron block, iron ore. And also that, that sort of moves as well. Look at that. Look at that shimmer on it. That looks really nice. We've got coal, coal block, and coal ore. Lapis, lapis block, and lapis ore. We've got emerald sort of um, piece, I'm going to call it. Emerald piece. Well, that to me, that looks actually more like an ingot. Uh, and the block there, and also the emerald uh, ore. We've got the diamond ore, the diamond block, and the diamond piece as well. And also nether quarters. We've got nether quarters up there. That looks more like um, that looks more like crystals there rather than it being nether quarters. I'm not sure what nether quarters is crystals. I don't know. Um, I don't know on that. And you've got the block and the ore. So yeah, that's them. Looking really good. Now we move on to the oak uh, or the wood. Sorry. Uh, I do have the other woods over there, which we'll go and check out in just a bit. Um, but yeah, we do have um, the oak wood here. So that looks pretty incredibly normal, to be honest. Uh, you know, the uh, trunk and all that sort of stuff is looking really nice. We want the spruce here. Of course, spruce is a lot more darker. It looks a lot more nicer as well. So that's that's really nice. We've got uh, birch here. That's really good. Liking the leaves, actually. I know they're kind of the same, but yeah, I do like them. And, of course, jungle. And I tell you what, I'm liking this block here. That looks really nice. <laughs> that block looks really nice. So we move on to grass and dirt. So there's two variants there. Also got sand, sandstone, chisel sandstone, and smooth sandstone. God, that's a mouthful. <laughs> and that's all this is around here as well. And, uh, yeah, must say, I do like um, sandstone, just regular, regular sandstone. I think that's regular sandstone. Yeah, it is. Yeah, so, yeah, I do like um, regular sand. So it does look nice in this texture pack, I will say. Just to get rid of that. So, yeah, here we have all of the um, clays, walls, carpets, stained glass, and also stained glass panels. And um, I'm not sure if the John Smith's uh, texture pack is based off anything. Uh, I'm not too sure on that. If you guys know, put a comment down below, but I really don't know. Um, but, yeah, we've got different ones here. This is white. And obviously white looks completely different to all the other ones. And we also got like light, light grey as well. That's that's light grey. And yeah, they look very different there. And also that is clay and or hardened clay and normal clay. Also got the pistons. Sticky and non-sticky. Furnace up here. And the dispenser down here. So got a uh, note block up here, which looks really nice. And the jukebox as well. So it's got TNT, <laughs> it's got creeper face on it. Beware of uh, me, because I will blow you up. <laughs> got the wooden pressure plate, the stone pressure plate, the golden weighted pressure plate, and of course the iron weighted pressure plate as well there. Also got redstone here as well, and the lamp, which I'll turn on for you. That looks really nice, you can see the redstone there being turned on. That's really, that looks really nice, sorry. Uh, we've also got rails, so we've got normal rail, powered rail, activator rail, and detector rail. Also ladder as well. The nether portal. Just look at that. That looks really, really nice. And of course, the spawn eggs. So we will get into that now. And uh, yeah, I must say the spawn eggs are looking really nice as well. So that's all it's all good. So we'll just uh, do that. Put, put me back on. Um, so this is a creeper. Oh, wow. Creeper looks very like innocent <laughs> in, that, in that phase there. Not like me. Not me then. Maybe I shouldn't have punched it. There's a skeleton. Oh my god. Wow, look at the skeleton. They look beast. Oh, <laughs> here's a spider. It's got no mouth. It's got like pincers for, for, for mouth. What the hell? Just, just have a look at that a minute. It's got pincers. Just, there's a zombie. That looks really good as well. There is a slime. This, I tell you what, this texture pack is looking better and better as it goes on. There is a enderman. I hope you saw the face on it. Well, they just keep disappearing. Um... Here is a cave spider, and again has mini pincers. 
a silverfish which has not changed and a bat which also has not changed uh, so hopefully they, they have changed all these I'm just going to set a peaceful because uh, this is how crap my PC is now I have to set the peaceful and easy to actually get rid of them so I can put more um, more enemies down and more you know mobs down stuff like that because it can't handle that many uh, stuff on the screen at once because of crap it is anyway so this is a witch and oh my god what the fuck is that is this like a pig with a face with a big ass fucking nose so that's what a pig looks like okay see that face should be on the pig <laughs> that would look so much better there's a sheep um here's a cow wow this is this is quite a nice texture pack actually um a chicken looks really nice a squid which uh, I, don't, I don't I don't know if it's purple or if it's just suffocating. No, it's purple. Uh, a wolf. There's a wolf there. It's really nice. A horse. That's a donkey. A horse, which has not changed, neither as a donkey. A villager, with has the same <laughs> has the same stupid looking face. Oh god. Uh, I'm just gonna show you a ocelot and a mushroom. So his ocelot which has changed big time and a mushroom with no things on the back of it yes someone has actually done it someone has made a mushroom with no mushrooms on its back i've been waiting for that for so long thank you john smith if you're a real person or if it's just based off the drink i really don't know but thank you very much you've done us all one big hell of a victory with that okay so that is all of the spawn eggs let's go into the netherworld and check the netherworld out Hopefully this is going to look really good. Um, oh my god, there's a lot of stuff in here. <laughs> um, so I'm just going to just set it to peaceful just a second. Just to wipe all them off. So we've got a lot, you know, it's a lot more fast on my PC. So first of all, I'm going to run through this and then we'll check out the spawn eggs. So first of all, we have is glowstone, which I've shown, well, not really shown you. I'll show you the, um, the lamp. And the lamp pretty much looks the exact same as the glowstone. If I just get the lamp, actually. And... Um, just kind of place it next to it. They kind of do look the same. Yeah. If I get a a, a lever, is it? I can't spell it. There we go. And turn it on. It's literally the exact same. That's why I thought it was a lamp when I first said it. So yeah, there is a uh, there's glowstone. There's the nether brick set. So we've got the nether brick slab, block, stairs, and fence. Even though fence is like completely different color to the rest of it. Uh, we have nether nether rack, uh, soul sand, and also lava now that's awesome it's all bu bubbly and stuff and uh, looks really really cool we've also got the mushrooms over here as well uh, i want to see some that just random fire oh, we've got some random fire that looks really nice as well and uh, yeah it looks, looks all it's all sway and stuff so yeah let's put on the um let's put on the mobs and check out these first or these these set of spawn eggs so first what we have is a magma cube and the magma cube has not changed which is kind of disappointing. There is a zombie pigment. Oh my fucking god. Let's just see that again. Oh dear. That is horrible. We have a blaze. Which just looks really intense. Looks like it would rip your face off. And also the gas. Which looks like a giant sort of floating. I don't know. Skull I guess. It looks. It doesn't look very pleasant. It looks horrible. If you saw that coming towards you, you'd be like, what the fuck is that? It's actually coming towards me. Go away. I need to put it back to <laughs> peaceful. <laughs> so, yeah, guys. Hopefully, you have enjoyed this video. Um, sorry again for not getting a video out um, last week and also this one being late. Hopefully, today, I can get this video out and also my mod showcase. If it doesn't come out today, it will definitely be coming out tomorrow. Uh, why is this villager different to the rest of them? I don't know. I don't know why that's happened. Villagers are, like, random. Um, but yeah, that is pretty much it. So hopefully you have enjoyed the video again. If you have, please leave a like. Please subscribe for more videos on Minecraft Xbox, PC and Pocket Edition. Also, if you subscribe, you'll keep up to date with my Texture Pack Mondays, my Mod Showcase Tuesdays, and also my Survival um, Let's Play on a Wednesday, if not a Thursday, which will be on the Xbox. Hopefully I'll be doing one on the PC very soon with my brand new computer. And until next time, guys, have a good one. Bye.